Hey everybody, this is Eric Clark's Travel Videos and I'm here in uh, Budapest, Hungary and it is cold today. I mean, it was miserable yesterday. It was really cold, so I really didn't do much. I stayed inside and pretty much uh, watched movies and hung out and took care of some other stuff. But uh, today is the same way. So right now it is 30 degrees outside, 30. And so it looks like it's going to hit a high of about uh, 34 or something. So it's, it's really cold. So today is a laundry day, but it's also um, bean and ham day. Let me go show you. Okay, so it's a cold day, and so for me, when it gets really cold, I really crave like soups. And so I made a potato soup the other day, and it was really wonderful. And today I'm making um, beans and ham. And so I've been soaking my beans um, since about four this morning, and it's eight, so it's been in there for about four hours. So I'll leave it sit for another, I don't know, a couple hours. Um, and then I've got my ham and I went to the store and I got uh, smoked ham and it was a big piece and so I chopped it up, took all the funky stuff off and gristle and any kind of weird stuff I found. And then I've got my onion and I've got my uh, garlic and, uh, and I'll do salt and pepper, but I'll show you what it looks like when I start to cook it. I gotta go find some bay leaves. It's funny, I looked on the internet and I was uh, looking at uh, YouTube videos about how people make this. And it's funny, they say theirs is the easiest and they add, you know, thyme and they add parsley and they add carrots and potatoes and, and all of them seem to add more than my mom ever did. And maybe it was just because we, we kind of grew up really kind of poor. And so I think she probably learned this recipe from her mother and her great grandmother and down the line. And so really it's, it's the beans, it's the ham, a little garlic, an onion, and uh, uh, bay leaves, and then salt and pepper. And then you just cook it until it's uh, soup. Anyway, I'll show you what it looks like when we get it going. Bye, everybody. Okay, so my beans have been uh, soaking for, gosh, how many? So quite a few hours, six or seven hours, eight hours. And so you can see that they're... Uh, They've, they've certainly uh, filled up a bit. So we strain them, and I don't like the, to fill up the sink and have the beans sitting in whatever was in the sink, so I always hold up the strainer. Okay. Oops. So anyway, so there's my beans. And we're gonna rinse them. Let's make sure they don't go down the drain, shall we? So we rinse the beans off the best we can and get them, you know, that looks pretty good. Because, you know, beans are, you know, sometimes dirty. Like when, when I put them in the pan, before I put them in the pan, I put them on the counter and I found two rocks. And so that's not uncommon. I know that happens in America. This is... Uh, Budapest so I'm sure it's the same way so here um, I, I don't know I guess I expected that there might be more rocks anyway okay so those are rinsed so we're going to take those and stick them back in the pan here all right good to go and now we're going to fill it with water. And, and it's going to cook down a little bit. So obviously, so I think, oh, I think that's, that's probably good. So now what we're going to do is we need to slide this over to this way. And then I need to do the onion and the garlic. So let me get on that and I'll be right back. Okay, so the beans are here. So now what I've done is I've uh, chopped up and diced my onion and then I have a little bit of garlic, two cloves, two little, well they're not crazy little, but they're not uh, crazy big either. Um, and the onions are gonna boil down to small size. So we're just gonna go ahead and stick that in there. Dunk, dunk. They'll get softer, I guess, it's not smaller size. but. And I don't know, I guess I don't mind a little onion. So uh, some people I notice say a little onion, some people say a lot of onion, some people say sweet onions. I just get an onion, I don't know. <laughs> so 
So you stick that in there. Then the ham. So then I got all this ham. And that's a lot of ham. There's probably that's probably a good, you know, whatever. Is it a pound? I don't know. Um, now the hardest part about this meal is, um, at least here in um, Budapest, <laughs> was finding this. Bay leaves. Um, and they're not bay leaves, they're called uh, Babarol, whatever. And so I'm going to take some of this and we're going to drop in probably, let's do, let's do that many. I don't know. And, uh, and then we'll go from there. Then we need to do some salt and some pepper. And so there's the pepper. And I don't mind a little pepper. Now on the salt, you have to be careful because ham is kind of salty. So that's probably enough pepper. Ham is kind of salty, but beans are kind of, you know, um, not salty. So <laughs> I don't, so you, so I would get it going first and let it sit for a while. You know, not very much comes out of this. You can see that, you know, I could shake here for 20 minutes and still not get much. But uh, so anyway, so that's that. Um, and then what else? And I think that's really it. We're going to let that cook um, on low. Let's put that up there and get it going. And we're going to have beans for dinner, everybody. Okay, I'll be back. Okay, it's uh, it's getting a little warmer, but you want it to really just get to a spot where it's kind of like a low boil, like really low boil. And my pot's pretty full, <laughs> so I'm, I'm uh, trying to take out a little bit of water um, just so that it doesn't boil over if it starts to boil. Um, so we're just looking for a slow simmer, and, uh, and it's getting... It's getting warmer, so I think we're we're getting close to that stage. Also, I threw in a titch of parley or parsley, parsley, parley. <laughs> I threw in a fight, um, but I threw in a little parsley just to give it a little more flavor and stuff too. Anyway, so what's in here? Beans, onions, garlic, salt, pepper, bay leaves, and a little bit of par parsley. And so, uh, off to the races. So, anyway, I'll come back when it starts to, to get going. Okay, bye everybody. Okay everybody, you can see that it's uh, getting a little warmer. It's starting to steam and getting close to a soft boil. Um, and it's certainly uh, warm. I gotta get it up there a little bit hotter, but I don't want it to burn the bottom. You know these little pans aren't the best of pans, and so you gotta be you gotta be careful. So anyway, cool. It's looking good though. Wow. Okay, I shall return. Bye everybody. Okay. It's looking pretty good. And it tastes wonderful, and it smells wonderful, and my whole house smells like ham and beans. Wonderful. The onions are getting to be opaque, and uh, I don't know, we'll let it keep uh, simmering for a while here, and uh, it should be ready around 4 o'clock maybe. Wow. Mmm. Amazing. Okay, bye-bye. Okay, well the soup is done and so I'm gonna get a little bowl here and we'll give it a test. So here's my little cup and my, uh, my look at that. Does that look wonderful? Oh my gosh. Mmm. All right, here we go. It's pretty hot though, so. Mmm. Wow. Mmm. Oh, and the beans are perfect. Not too soft and mushy, but uh, not firm and crunchy. <laughs> Can you see it? Oh. Mmm. 
So let's try some of the meat. Here's a couple chunks of meat. Um, so this should be good too. And it is pretty hot. Mmm. Wow. That is amazing. Thanks for watching me make beans, everybody. Bye-bye.